How to claim your PPY balance in peer plays. This is particularly of interest for people who were involved in the crowdfunding of peer plays during the ICO prior to June 2017. So now I'm no expert, but hopefully this video will really help you uh, show you how to set up and claim your PPY balance. First thing you want to do is download the peer plays wallet onto your computer and then follow the instructions within. So if we click on the green button on the peer plays website, it says claim the PPY balance. And this takes us to GitHub, which is where coders post up their information uh, for, um, for, uh, for their programs, basically. So what we want to do is download, depending on which version of peer plays you want, if you're on Linux, if you're on OS X, um, I'm on a PC, so I'm going to use the .exe. It's a 38.9 megabyte download, so we click on that. This is open source software, so people, uh, developers can check this software and, and renew it and so on. So just downloading this, I'm on Google Chrome, so you can see in the bottom corner here, it's downloading seven megabytes of the 38 megabytes there. So once that's downloaded, then hopefully it's going to be a simple process of just running this program and it will give me the instructions. I want to get my passwords ready as well at the moment. So I'm just, whilst that's downloading, getting my passwords and keys ready to be able to log in to my um, wallet here. GUI, by the way, stands for Graphical User Interface. So in other words, how does it look? It presents it graphically and that's a uh, you know, nice way of being able to access your wallet. So let me just go and get my passwords and things here and I'll come back once this is fully downloaded and show you what to do next. Okay, so that's the Peer Plays wallet uh, program downloaded. So I just need to run this now. So let's go here and it's going to open the program. Okay, so on my computer we just get a warning screen on Windows 10. It just says your check your internet connection Windows smart screen can't be reached right now uh, whether to run this program. So this is the installer program. So click install to begin. So let's click on next. And that's where it's going to store it on the computer. And it's going to extract the files and run this program. Okay, so that's the peer plays program running. It says can't connect to blockchain, try again. So let's click on this. It's looking a little bit more hopeful, some good graphics there. Okay, so that's now opened uh, this message in the program and it says please enter a username starting with a letter and contain at least one dash or number. So if you don't have an account sign up so we need to sign up for an account first of all so it says here for all other ppy balance claims sign up and then go to the settings balance claims so let's click sign up so i need to choose an account name it says please enter a username starting with a letter and contain at least one dash or number so i'm going to put in my chosen there i'm going to make a note of this so i need to copy my account password Okay, so I just store that in a Word document, which is also password protected, just to give me the extra security. And what I tend to do with the passwords is just check the first and last character to make sure I've got it all copied, which I do. So I now need to put that back in there, uh, re-enter generated password, so that confirms you have copied it. And you need to, if you lose your password, you lose all of your funds. Please keep your safe, your password safe. Uh, to download a text file of your password, click link below. So let's say I understand you can't recover passwords. I've securely saved my generated password. Actually, I'm going to download that as well just as a second file. So that's going to download it as a text file. So I'll just store that. So I'm just going to store that on my computer. I've also got it in my Word document, which I have now. Let's just save that just in case the computer crashes. That is now saved, so now I click Create Account. Okay, so this is my PPY PeerPlays wallet. First time I've seen this. Uh, this is very encouraging, it actually looks correct. And 
Okay, so now to claim my balance of PPY, according to the PDF document, I need to go to Settings, and then go to Balance Claims. So, Redemption Key, Paste Private Keys here. So, when I first applied on the crowdfunding, I had my private key, which I've got in my Word document here, so let's just copy that, paste that there, and then click look up balances and okay it's found my unclaimed PPY balance so now I click claim balance okay and I'm going to go and confirm that that all seems good that's what I want to do I want to get my PPY coins from uh, the crowdfunding so I click confirm on this screen as well because that all still matches up the information I was expecting and that says that's done so let's just tick that box so I'm assuming now it's going to be in my funds. If I go back to my funds, I should be able to see it. And there it is. There's my available balance. Obviously, I'm going to keep that off the screen at the moment. I don't want you to know how much I've actually invested in peer plays, but I'm happy with that. I know at the moment the peer plays is trading on the exchange, the uh, the Deo exchange for fifteen dollars a peer play, so fifteen dollars per PPY. So I can see there that. Um, initial looks like I've uh, made about 250% growth gain on my uh, investment in PPY so far. Very happy to keep hold of those. I think uh, PeerPlays has got a massively long way to go. Hopefully you've found this video useful. It's the first time I've done it. Uh, it was quite daunting. You've seen it as I've recorded it effectively live. Hope you found this useful. Feel free to comment and share on this video and thanks for watching this is Paul Hardingham from paulhardingham.com